What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Hello fellow Chiefs, this is Catching Fire 3 with more Life is Strange and I'm gonna turn the page. Oh man, there we are making pancakes. I love that show. Oh my god, I know what's gonna happen. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. Yeah, because it was to you was. probably. Me too. This photo... Maybe I could... Take it out? Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing. Yeah, I know already. And I can fix it. I can it's totally fix it. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So when is this made again? Because zonked seems like a word that nobody uses anymore. While my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible. Maybe Stop. I feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Pull the plug. Understand? Yeah, I knew it. She yes, wants me to pull the plug. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. <laughs> Except, I guess, it depends what happens. I don't know what'll happen. But... I'll just drift asleep, dreaming of us here together, forever. Oh my god, this is heartbreaking. This hurts. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. Oh my god, this is... This is insane. Grab the picture already. Come on, what, what are you waiting for? Grab the picture, fix this. You saw her die and you will fix it. Focus on the I'm photo. Sorry, I'm almost there. Hold on. Yep, got it. And now I'm going to fix this. Someday dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Now I just have to wait for him to oh. get run over again or hey, something. Honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get those. Of course I'll come pick you up. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. Oh no, the swear jar is back! Not the swear jar! Aha! You can't hide from me forever. I'm glad I didn't have to hear that no again. Oh, I get why she burnt it. So she doesn't go back in time and fuck up again. Wow. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. 
I tried to make things different for you. I... I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like my whole life. You're my best friend. And I can't. I can't. Family, what's to be sorry for? We'll be best I can't ever. talk because this is just mind-boggling. Mind-boggling. Mind -boggling. I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. Always. Whoa! That's a lot to handle. Now he's dead and back to the old photos. <sighs> but are they all gonna be the same photo though? Yep. And David Madsen? Better be someone else instead? Okay, nope, it's still that creepy guy. Oh, but that's why that picture that picture was telling us that when she got a new car. Okay, I see now. You wouldn't have gotten that and Oh my god, they had a picture of her. Oh my god, they actually had pictures like this. And I had no idea. Oh, oh, oh my god. This is crazy, but at least Chloe has been, I mean, Max has been there longer than she was before. So she changed a little bit of the past and the present or future, I guess. What the hell? kiss now you're all over me I'm just I'm just I'm so glad you're here you sound high but thanks for the morning growth. good morning girl we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together Max did you forget we've gone over this I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping not anymore I'm just spaced out too oh my Welcome god to the real world Oh my god, finally I'm back. So what did we do? Let's look. So what did we do? I heard that, Max. I want to see the picture. Oh, I can't see the picture. Okay, whatever. It's not that good. Well, I mean, it's better than most, I guess. So what am I supposed to do? Board. Okay. Come on. So close yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. The dark room? I don't have a gun anymore. Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. So at least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. Oh my god, this Cyber is insane. It's, 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 it's I'm just step. like, blanked out now. Camera. Step, <laughs> wait, I missed that. Did she just call him partner. Step Crack? Oh my god. I can't. Yeah, don't abuse that power again. No. That poor little bird has been trapped in here. Little birdie bird. Little birdie. 
Birdie. Where's that damn bird? It went down this way, right? Cabinet, it wouldn't be in the cabinet. There you are, you little bastard. What if that birdie is the alternate reality, uh, Chloe? That'd be kind of interesting, I guess. That would bring a whole new theory to stuff like that. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you, ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. The dark? Is that a... To the dark room? Did I change the future? What the fuck? What the hell happened? Looks like David already booked a room. Okay. Yo, yo, Max, your friend Chloe texted me. I'm out of the loop now. She sounds hot, so I get why. Chloe actually texted you? I sure didn't, didn't have her number. At least I still get to go ape with you unless you want to chill with Chloe. Or we could all go. One pain in the ass is enough. Cool. I have to jet talk to you later. Okay. This is fucking insane. Like, I have nothing to say. I thought I could make jokes. But I couldn't after that. I think that drained me a little. Of course, not as much as it w would if I was in that situation because I'd have to witness like a friend die. Maybe there's some new clues around. Whoops, that was my disc drawer. Email? Should I have signed the petition? Blackwell sure isn't safe and private anymore. Despite a rather heated discussion about the successful petition to block a campus surveillance system, I am still interested in your feedback on other methods of improving Blackwell security. We must find a middle ground between safety and privacy oh, for our students. Grant. Twist that knife. At least he has one weird fan. I just wanted to let you know I think it's bullshit what happened to you in this school. There's too many... Um, should I say that? Because it's not really a nice word. I don't think... I don't think anybody is wrong when it comes to voting. But I'm not going to get too political. I just think that there's no good choices, like, in the past eight years. So, yeah. I just wanted to let you know I think it's bullshit. Uh, libtard metrosexuals who don't appreciate you or the military I felt safe in my dorm when you were in charge and I thought about you protecting me I hope you will come back to Blackwell and make sure we are all safe at night I'm scared I had of this surveillance school. footage of that conversation I apologize for my outburst yesterday in your office I was upset about losing my position at Blackwell without without a complete investigation of the facts and based solely on the claims of untrust fucking asshole there is a cancer what the hell Okay, map. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts too. That's crazy. Who would have thought? I mean, I wouldn't have. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe well, I mean, did too. Technically she did. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. Yeah, I don't like the thought of him being armed. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Sex. They each gave each other fellatio 69 style. I don't fucking know. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey David, what you hiding? But he has the key. Oh yeah, I've... I was totally thinking I was supposed to get morphine for Chloe. God, that fucked me up. 
For once, I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, and I need to find a way to break this padlock. Okay, hopefully nobody sees her. Hey, oh, I was ho well. That wouldn't have worked in real life. I wonder if it would have worked in the game. What's that? Paper ball, crowbar. There we go. Got it. Okay. Got what I'm using. I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. But then he'll see that somebody was trying to sneak into his shit, which is kind of stupid. Sorry, David, but I bet you would do the same thing as me. I bet he would. What you doing? Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Oh, is that a... Holy shit. Holy shit. Score. Back to Chloe now. Now we have all the evidence to put him behind bars, I guess? I'm not super sure. Call Yo, Chloe. Chloe. Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Oh jeez. The hell out This is kind of fucked up. It. But I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. Oh, I was going to say maybe she has Rapex, but then I realized that's not a thing. I shouldn't have said that. Probably shouldn't have said that. You know what? Just do some research about it, and you'll know what it is. This is definitely Kate's floor. The hospitals always freak me out. I hear you, but imagine how Kate feels. I just hope I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little nervous. Just go in there and be your friend. I'll wait out here so you can chill by yourselves. I was a total dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored me. I had no idea what shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. I'm sorry. Oh, finally you're mushy or whatever. Thanks, Chloe. But don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes. <laughs> I'm on it. Go in there already. Please don't tell me she committed suicide or something in there. Oh, I had to actually press the walk button or whatever. She looks so much better. Still has a red nose, but not as red as before. Max. Okay, Kate. no, she looks terrible still. I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate, listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. Because Liar! She does not look awesome. Okay, maybe she looks a little awesome, but I wouldn't go as far as awesome, awesome. Now that like, maybe here, in between awesome and okay. I'm so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw how much you cared, how hard you were trying. You made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Kate, there are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. Well, I had you to, I think, as well. Postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. I'm keeping the balloons, though. Of and course you are. The balloons are awesome. And paper so I could do some drawings. <laughs> Looks great. They got I, what is it? <laughs> But I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. I was thinking of having some photographs in there, too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. Of I'm course. I'm going to be here for another day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. 
They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty. Wait a second. Do anything. Go back to that I angle for a second. Was there a mustard bottle there? Oh my god, are they making- Oh my god. Oh my god, no. No, get away from this, please. There was a not ketchup, a mustard bottle and a hot dog in the- There were hearts about- See, there it is, there it is, there it is. Hold on, let me go over there. I want to go see that. Look at that. Oh my god, that, that's terrible, Kate. Jesus Christ. It is so good to hang out with you again. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. Nathan. I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I You didn't even put a finger a finger to strong how close. Pay for what he did. And we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. I wish I could have gotten his ass kicked out of Blackwell. Me too. But his dad would never let that happen. I thought I had a tough family. So what is going on with him now? I think his family is totally protecting him. Or worse. I grooming him. This about people. But Max, there's something evil about the You know what's box. evil about them? They all do they drugs or something. We're going to stop him. I just have to find Nathan's room number, get inside, and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number, and I'll text it to you, okay? Of course, Kate. I can't do this Does that you. have consequences? Now it's time for Nathan to watch out for us. What do you mean, consequences? I always want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. That was so not cool. We need to plan, like, a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh, yes! Portland, and Maine? Portland, Oregon? Probably Portland, too. Maine. No boys allowed. <laughs> you are funny, Max. And right. I have to get back to our uh, mission. You don't know how much it means to see you again. I she do. probably does. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. Your bunny? Oh, Alice, I'll see her soon. Alice? Who the hell is Alice? Is there anything I can look at? There's a postcard and a letter. Nah. Nothing interesting. I guess I'll leave the hospital now. That was quick. Well, who is she? She's still Kate Marsh. Thank God. I'm glad we came to see her. Thanks for coming with me. Now, let's That's fucking gay. No. <laughs> Wait, I can't say that in June. Damn it. Whatever. Unless I guess you know it's a joke. If you like this video, leave a like, comment down below if you want to see more or what you want me to do next. Subscribe if you're new and may the odds be ever in your favor. Have a great day, guys.